Hey guys, back again with another education update from the library. Are you sometimes overwhelmed by the number of tools available out there? Or maybe worrying that you're missing out on tools that make your life a whole lot easier? Mm. Well, we made just a thing to help you with that. The student toolbox and the teacher tool wheel. In both of these online tools about tools, we index tools by their use. So instead of starting with the tool, you start with what you actually want to do. Let me show you. This is the student toolbox. On the right hand side, you can see a list of all the things a student might want to do in regards to education. When you hover over any of these, it automatically shows you which tool is best suited for the job. And of course, it works the other way around too. In the teacher tool wheel, we have added an extra layer that is about what you as a teacher want students to do. For example, let's say you want them to do a discussion. You click on this piece of the pie and it zooms in to an overview where you find all the tools that assist you in doing online discussions. Next to that, every page has a list of teaching methods on the right hand side, which again interactively shows you which tools are related as well as the other way around. We also separated all tools by their license level. License level 1 means that it's integrated within our learning management system Canvas. For example, a discussion board within your course. Level 2 also means it's in license, just not within Canvas. For example, WooClap, the tool for making every presentation interactive. And level 3 means it isn't licensed, but we do recommend it because it's free to use or has a trial version. Of course, both tools allow you to click on any tool logo to find out more information about the tool. You can find the student toolbox and the teacher tool wheel at the Maastricht University portal for online education as well as on the library website. Also, we've provided links in the description below. If you have any feedback, let us know in the comments. And if you find this video helpful, it would be awesome if you would share it with your colleagues and fellow students. See you next time.